If you are a voiceover artist or you own a YouTube channel and you find it hard to get a noise-free environment to record your audio, how about I show you how you can go past that by cloning your voice with AI? Especially if you own an AI-powered channel which may be at a risk of demonetization. Cloning your own voice brings about that authenticity that YouTube looks for in every video. This video also answers the questions of my amazing subscribers on how to clone their voice with AI. Let's begin. This video is divided into two segments. Let's start with the first segment, record your audio. To clone your voice with AI, have your voice as samples saved on your PC. Let's get my unique voice. I'll head on to my YouTube channel to get my voice. I'll copy my YouTube link and search YouTube to MP3 on Google. There are several websites to download YouTube audio. Let's use this website, paste the link, and download the audio. I'll need five samples, so let me divide this long-form audio. Afterwards, I'll search Audio Cutter on Google. Let's go with this online web tool. The interface is easy to use. Play it here. I'll show you how you can do the same with two AI tools and earn up to $10,000 in a month by either selling it as a service on freelance marketplaces or starting a faceless YouTube channel. As a bonus tip, move through the audio file. I'll make my samples one minute each. Save it here and it'll download. If you want to record your audio files afresh, ensure it's clear and audible. A pro tip is to go over to podcastabode.com or search Adobe Enhancer on Google and register with your Gmail. Choose or drop your samples to improve the quality of your voice. Wait for some seconds or minutes. On or off the enhanced speech here to see the difference. You want to make it sound realistic and not robotic. Create an account with your email and go to the speech synthesis. There, choose your voice settings. That's amazing, right? Download it and do the same for the other samples. Now that the audio files are ready, let's begin the second segment. Clone your voice. This is where the real work begins. So if you are yet to subscribe to my channel, kindly do so now so you won't miss the next AI update like this. There are AI voice cloners like Tortoise TT's, Revoicer, Speechify, and Typecast.ai among others. But while some are not free, others are technical. I'll show you a more easy way with the AI voice cloner called Eleven Labs. Visit elevenlabs.io. Click on Try for Free and register with your Gmail account. In the pricing section, you can use Eleven Labs for free with 10,000 characters a month, a $1 plan for the first month with 30,000 characters, and $11 monthly for 100,000 characters. Using the free plan, you can create up to three custom voices. Isn't that amazing? Let's continue. Go to Voice Lab, click Add Generative or Cloned Voice. You will see the different types of voices you can create. Go to Instant Voice Cloning, choose a name, then upload your samples. Keep in mind that you can only upload audio files of less than 10 MinBy. Since Adobe Enhancer will produce large audio files, search Compressed MP3 on Google to resize the files. Let's use OnlineConverter.com. Add the files, let's leave the quality to default, click Convert. Download it here once it's done and do the same for all the samples. Let's add our samples to Eleven Labs. Add a description, I use. A young lady with an energetic and vibrant voice suitable for teaching educational content. Let's activate this and add clone. Now let's go to our speech synthesis, click here to add your cloned voice, edit the settings, the stability, clarity, and style exaggeration. Add your script or text here and click Generate. Let's listen to it and compare it with the original voice. As a bonus tip, I'll also show you how you can create your talking avatar. As a bonus tip, I'll show you how to create your talking avatar. If it doesn't sound the way you want it, you can change the stability or clarity. Another tip is going over how to voice lab. You'll see your cloned voice, click Edit, and you can make a few changes like your labels and description to make it slow. Let's preview it. As a bonus tip, I'll show you how to create your talking avatar. You can check history and you'll find your generated voices. With this knowledge, you can automate your process as a YouTuber or voiceover artist, especially when you have loads of projects to complete. If you've gained something by watching this video, I'd be happy if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like, and share this video. Is there any question you might have as regards cloning your voice? Let me know in the comment section and I'd be happy to help.